For containment uses, HH66 is used to bond geomembranes so that installations remain waterproof and stay permanent in spaces that are measured not just in feet, but sometimes in acres. However, to get the best result, you've got to use it right. When working with HH66 vinyl cement, you'll always follow three steps. Step one is prepare. Wear gloves when using HH66 and work in a well-ventilated area away from sparks or flames. You'll want some rags on hand for cleanup, and we recommend having a two to four inch chip brush along with a paint bucket or paint roller tray to paint on your adhesive. Lay your membranes with a standard overlap of around 12 inches. Try to have the area you'll bond relatively clean. The less dirt and debris, the easier it is to add the adhesive and make a strong bond. Now you're ready for step two, apply. For large areas, we suggest working in sections of about three to four feet in length at a time and then repeating the application process. Start at the center of your membrane. We're going to bond the middle and then work our way outward so any wrinkles are easy to remove. Spread a band of adhesive at least four inches wide across the surfaces of both membranes. A four inch layer ensures you'll get a watertight bond and 12 inches of overlap means you'll have plenty of area to work with, even if the membranes don't line up perfectly. Let the adhesive sit for about two minutes until it turns tacky. If you're working on a three to four foot section, when you're done spreading on the adhesive, you're probably ready for step three. Attach. Press your membranes together firmly and work from the middle out. You can use a roller, hands, or feet, but be sure to keep the pressure even throughout. HH66 will dry in about an hour, but the bond keeps getting stronger for about a day. At that point, you'll have made a bond that's actually stronger than the PVC you glued together. If you'd like to test your work, the best way to do that is through what's known as the air lancing test. Moving down the seam between membranes, you can blow compressed air at the bonded area and watch for delamination or peeling. If you see the membrane separating, there's a problem with your seal. If not, you've got a quality bond, and that means your installation is ready to face whatever nature throws at it. Our goal at RH Adhesives is to give you peace of mind. That starts with having the right glue for the task at hand, and it ends with you doing your best work.